Yo, what's going on guys? Your boy Boogie again. <laughs> Shake <-A> B. <laughs> and welcome back to another one. I mean, y'all can tell just by how the sun is shining on my face, how it's brightening my day. It's just the nice day out right now. I just had to be outside and enjoy this weather. I just took my dog for a walk and you know, I gotta come outside and get some good content. You know the vibes, man. Subi, Subi. You saw from the last video, I got the STI wing for the WRX. And man, let me tell you, I've been liking this wing every day more and more. Just, it's just a nice look on the car. I really didn't think it was gonna look that nice, but it turned out to look really good on the car. And just once I get that front end done, I think this is gonna be solid. But then something happened. So as you know, the people of the car community, we hunt on Facebook Marketplace for parts because just the opportunities that we see on Facebook Marketplace is honestly crazy sometimes. And that's what happened. I found something very interesting and it's only about 30 to 40 minutes away from my crib. So I came upon a 2.5 RS Super. It's pretty clean, but it's a part out. And the reason why I'm interested in it is it's red. It's all red and it has a windless trunk on the back. And they said, we'll part out anything that you need or anything that you want on the car. Hit us up. So I hit them up, I asked them how much for the trunk. And he's only asking a hundred dollars for the freaking trunk. And I'm like, man, a hundred dollars for a trunk that's all red and pretty much clean and ready to go from what I saw in the pictures. I'm about to go head up there now to go take a look at it in person, see how I feel about it. Uh, see what the similarities to are with you know the quarter panels and front fenders with the Subi because I might just take those two if they're clean enough that'll save me some time you know other than trying to do everything over and repaint right now because that's just let's, let's let's see how it goes so we're about to head up there now that's why the Subi is all warmed up ready to go and we're about to have fun and uh, I think it's gonna be funny because they're probably not gonna expect a red WRX to pull up and they'll probably understand why I'm pulling up make a lot more sense for them we out y'all hey I see that wing back there <laughs> yo I'm telling you things growing on me but I think it's gonna be funny it's gonna be a tough decision to make between these trunks man if I do end up getting this Here and uh, here's 2.5 RS. All right, yeah, so here's the car up close. This is a 2.5 RS, it's like lower than a WRX. So <laughs> you thought a WRX was bad, this is 20 times worse. Nah, but I respect them in a way because they got something neat for me to take, like this trunk here. Um, the trunk looks good to me, I don't see no holes. Just a couple scratches, but I've got a couple scratches on my car anyway, so this really isn't a big deal. I'm definitely gonna take this trunk for sure. I'm just surprised with how good of an opportunity I got with this suit right here, man. Um, as you can see right here, every Subaru got this, that quarter panel rusting right there, man. It sucks, but every Subaru got this. on this side. Y'all can hear that, that's the wind. But the front doesn't look too bad. Yeah, the front doesn't look too bad. I kinda want to size my car up compared to this and just see more of a difference that way. All right, I'm about to move my Subi right next to it so I can get a better comparison look at it. Uh, see the differences, the ups and downs of it, and we'll get a better idea of what I want to do from here. 
All right, guys, I put both Subis in front of each other just to see the comparison between the 2.5 RS and the WRX, and there's still so many differences. Um, this, the fenders look pretty much the same, but those are damaged. Each fender, even quarter panel on the back, is all damaged, so no point even getting you know any fender or quarter panel up there so yeah so the only thing i really wanted out of for the subi was the trunk and it's sold 100 bucks for the trunk clean trunk no rust on it and now i got this trunk and that trunk to mess with this is going to be an interesting decision to make well um he said he won't be able to take the trunk off today because he has a lot of things going on around his shop here. So I'm going to come by tomorrow and pick it up. I already paid for it. $100, man. I pretty much got a great deal on both trunks in less than fucking a week. It's insane. But All right, y'all. It's currently the next day, and I'm back up here at the salvage yard. No more trunk on that car. And here it is, there's my trunk. Now I'm going to pick it up, put it over there, over reliable, the Buick, the daily, the one and only, and head back home. All right, she's safely in, safe and sound, tucked away, boy. All right, I'll just uh, give you some more info about where I went. This is where I went, um, Ford and Sun Salvage in Westtown, New York. Not too far from where I'm at, so it was very convenient. And you can see right here, they gave me a bag with a couple goodies in it. Not too much, just a pen and a nice cool little light we got there. And hey, I appreciate it regardless. Because he didn't have to give me anything. But I do want to say thank you, RJ, because RJ was the guy that helped me out with the trunk and the one I did business with. Uh, pleasure doing business. You were very professional and you did a good job. You're overall a good person. So I really do appreciate you guys. And look, I'll come back if you have any more Subi parts like that again, because that was really, that really came in clutch. So I'm, I'm not even going to lie, but thank you so much. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, it's here. Just got back home. I just, I still can't believe the deals I got with these two chunks. I'm super happy with it. Because, God, what I mean, this was exactly what I was looking for. This is exactly what I was looking for. And I found it. But just not in enough time until I got an STI win. But I am very grateful for having this trunk as well. As much as this one. But the best thing about it is just like the money, how much money I spent. It's only spent a hundred bucks on that. And I've pretty much spent about a hundred bucks doing this. A little less. It's insane. So now I have to put this one on and do a comparison, you know, between which one I prefer more. Probably going to go for the wing, but I could be wrong again and say, wow, I like the wingless look, but... We're going to do a little competition. Yeah, so between these two trunks, we're definitely going to have some competing going on. We're going to do a little vote on which one is going to look better. But I still prefer the wing. That's just me. But I'm glad I still got this trunk just in case if I change my mind or I want to just change up the style a little bit. Now I have both. I got two things to mess with. So I'm happy. Alright y'all, I'm going to cut it off right here because your boy got some things to do other than this car stuff, unfortunately. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please go comment on, you know, which one is your favorite, the SCI wing, or do you think this wingless look is going to look better? Let me hear your opinion. I would love to hear it. Yes, so please go like, comment, subscribe for me, and please share it to a friend. Let them know about me. I'm just trying to show some love out here in the car culture, trying to change the game, man. But alright guys, you enjoy the rest of your day. I'm out of here. I'm about to go get something to eat. Peace.